parents. Well, with it being the first week of school, we want to get results for teachers and students in need of some supplies. Kirsten joins us now from our phone bank, where volunteers from A Gift for Teaching are standing by working the phones for you, waiting to take your call. Kirsten? And the phones are still ringing, Matt, but guess what? I have big news. We have reached our goal and exceeded it. We are now at $26,000 in donations for a gift for teaching. That is something to celebrate. But now we want to try and beat our goal from last year. So we want to get to $34,000. Keep those phones ringing. We want to introduce you now to our teacher who is going to give us some information about how this impacts her and her students. Sherry Craig Evans from Oak Ridge High School is with us tonight. Hi. Sherry, you have a wonderful personal story about how this has helped your students. I do. Um, two of the things that happened in the last school year were that Gift for Teaching had available uh, character pillows and books and we were able to get enough character pillows and books to give 150 little brothers and sisters gifts when they came to our winter showcase. Um, part of the performing arts team at Oak Ridge. I teach piano. And for the third time one of our students was selected to be the recipient of the Grant a Wish um, project that Gift for Teaching has. And he got a shopping spree at Christmas and he was able to pick out gifts for his entire family. He had never wrapped gifts before and the people at Gift for Teaching went in the back and found rolls of wrapping paper and ran them out. And we actually taught him to wrap gifts at school thanks to a Gift for Teaching. It's our monthly uh, team goal to go to Gift for Teaching and rack up on all of our school supplies. But it's not just supplies. Sometimes it's clothes and sometimes it's those extras that go into sharing with our students. That's why it's important that we raise funds so that teachers like me can continue to provide our students with the things they need and the little extras. And those are the things that just make teaching so admirable and I have so much respect for everybody who is able to help those students just like you. Sherry, thank you so much for sharing that with us and I'm so excited to have the phones continue to ring, Matt. We will check back in here with a gift for teaching very soon. Again, the number on your screen, 888-436-6665. Keep them coming. We just have the best viewers, Kirsten. Thank you.